This young couple's kitchen was far from perfect. It was very dated and tiny, with a usable space broken up in a galley layout with a dining room and living room on either side. Working with a starter home renovation budget, the task was to create a space to function as the heart of the home for entertaining and connecting with family. The new kitchen took over the existing dining space. A new island in the center created an additional workspace and allowed a place for people to gather while retaining the unobstructed views to the exterior from the living room. Glass pendants overhead inject personality without being too visually heavy. Other features in this kitchen include new stainless steel appliances, a pot filler over the range, and open shelving. The dining area was relocated to a space that had previously been converted from a carport. There, the paneled walls were finished with drywall, the drop ceiling was removed, and the vault was maximized to make it feel more integrated into the other public spaces. Despite working with a limited budget, this remodeler was able to create a major impact. This kitchen had not undergone any updates since the house was built in the 80s, and its mauve and pink color scheme with floral wallpaper showed its age. The kitchen was reconfigured by removing the wall dividing the kitchen and living spaces, along with relocating the laundry into the master bedroom. This created additional square footage to accommodate an oversized island featuring well-worn cabinetry. Design touches like a plank ceiling and oversized apron sink lend to the homeowner's farmhouse aesthetic. A closet was converted into a butler's pantry with wine refrigerator, ice machine, and wine glass storage. The kitchen is now fully open to the remodeled living room, allowing for an ease of entertaining. Wide vinyl plank flooring was installed throughout to resist wear and tear from the owner's boxers. The dated kitchen is now fully updated to handle the needs and desires of this young family. The homeowners wanted to expand their kitchen while retaining the existing layout, keeping the sink under the window and the stove where it was. A wall between the kitchen and dining room was removed to open up the space. A large island was added and topped with Carrera marble. White perimeter cabinets brighten up the room. A gray handmade ceramic tile backsplash was laid in a herringbone pattern to create a dramatic feel. The cedar vent hood was handmade on site by the project superintendent. Sliding barn doors conceal a small storage area. Brass finishes and lighting fixtures add a touch of warmth to the cool color scheme. Without making major floor plan changes, this once cramped kitchen has been turned into an open and airy space for all to enjoy. This homeowner was relocating to be near her grandchildren and needed an easy to maintain, open concept living area and kitchen to accommodate her little company coming over to grandma's house. The original space was divided and very dark. To open up the space, the peninsula housing the wet bar and refrigerator blocking the view to the living room was removed. In its place went a new island with seating on one side and ample storage on the other. The existing laundry was relocated to allow the kitchen to stretch along the entire back wall, giving the appearance of a much larger room. The cabinet display and storage allows pretty items to be seen while keeping utilitarian items hidden yet easily accessible. Electrolux built-in refrigerator freezer units and laundry were placed close to the action but hidden from plain view. Design details, such as a hex tile backsplash and a dramatic brass lighting fixture over the island, add a touch of modern to the classic white kitchen. By carefully reconfiguring the sequence of spaces, this project gave the homeowner the open concept she desired without going over budget. Having recently purchased their home, the client was eager to update the kitchen to better suit their personal style. The outdated cabinetry and island were removed and new top painted cabinets from Wellborn Cabinetry were installed. A new counter height bar was installed for the island, which included a downdraft vent placed behind the cooktop. 
a large veined Cambria countertop was installed to waterfall to the floor on both edges of the island. A floating cloud for lighting was placed above the island to provide plenty of light for cooking. Nestled inside an angled niche, the wet bar was updated with a modern vessel sink and cabinetry to match the rest of the kitchen. A gold palette runs through the kitchen, from the pendants to the bar stools to the island veining. The end result is a stunning showpiece that better suits the homeowner. With a design that was stuck in the past, this modern style house was in need of a serious kitchen update. The wall between the kitchen and dining room was removed and the opening into the kitchen from the hall was opened to create a more functional layout. A large triangle window was added to the top of the vaulted ceiling to match the existing window and bring symmetry to the room. A large deep blue island was installed with plenty of room for seating. Custom cabinets add a more streamlined and clean look that mimics the home's exterior. Glass backlit cabinets were installed on the upper level to feature family heirlooms and art. Originally located in the center of the room, the stovetop was relocated and a custom vent hood was installed above it. New hardwood floors were laid from the living area to the dining area and kitchen for a seamless flow. With a variety of subtle white tones throughout, the kitchen now has the modern look that blends with the rest of the home. This family of six wanted an open floor plan kitchen that captured their personality while meeting their daily needs. Walls were opened up and steel beams utilized to create a seamless transition between the kitchen and living area. A massive 18-foot island was designed with seating for six at one end and plenty of prep space along with room to house appliances. Creative storage drawers and cabinets keep items close at hand, yet out of the way when not in use. A conversation area was added for a quiet place to sit and talk while keeping an eye on kitchen activity. Rough-hewn timber from an old family barn was incorporated into the design, creating the centerpiece of the ceiling above the island. The timber was also used to create beams in the conversation area and on the television backdrop and was even sculpted with a chainsaw to create a vanity with recessed vessel sink in the newly relocated powder room. This kitchen is now the nucleus that it should have always been, ensuring that cooking, eating and living would be integrated activities for this family again. How do you update a kitchen into an efficiently flowing living space while maintaining the integrity of a home built in 1850? This remodeler did just that, starting by demoing the existing kitchen and removing existing converging pocket doors. Antique heart pine was used for beams in the new coffered ceiling, as well as in the construction of the kitchen island. An antique iron lighting fixture acquired by the homeowner was hung over the island as the centerpiece of the kitchen. Heart pine was also used to construct the large custom curving hood for the 48-inch wolf range. The countertops and backsplash around the range and hood were made from Calcutta marble. A pass-through opening was created to allow access to the sunroom. A custom wainscot panel was designed to house and conceal a 50-foot existing fire hose. The adjacent laundry room was updated as well to coordinate with the kitchen. The space now fits perfectly with the home's historic feel without ever seeming dated. This kitchen was cramped, out of date and disorganized, providing no solutions to any of the homeowner's problems and even creating problems on a daily basis. The kitchen was expanded and turned into a chef's dream with custom inset cabinetry, marble countertops and backsplash, and professional grade appliances. As she discovered her love of cooking, the homeowner had collected cookbooks from all walks of life, and they are now proudly displayed in the bookcases flanking the entry into the new casual dining area. A pantry was added behind a handcrafted barn door. Next to the pantry is a new bar area that showcases handmade tile and a custom wood countertop, 
to make early mornings more manageable. A storage closet was added to serve as a mudroom for coats, boots, and other seasonal attire. The kitchen is now full of solutions for this young family, providing functionality on a daily basis, as well as for entertaining friends and guests. The homeowners wanted to update and create a bright inviting mother-in-law suite in their finished basement. All of the existing flooring, cabinets, backsplash, appliances, and bath fixtures were removed to completely update the space. New cabinets were designed and installed in the kitchen and den area. A new range was placed under a custom-built hood with a marble backsplash. The new island was designed to include a marble countertop, three-stool dining counter, and a stainless steel farmhouse sink. In the new bathroom, tile was placed on the floor and in the shower, and a custom cabinet built with a coordinating mirror. A new laundry room was incorporated into the design as well. Cabinets and shelves were added to the hobby room. To complete the basement, a fireplace was built with bookshelves on both sides. The basement porch saw the addition of an underdecking waterproof ceiling with can lights and a ceiling fan. All of these modifications have come together to create a cozy and comfortable basement living space. Ever since they purchased their house, these homeowners had considered a main level addition project. After realizing that they would be without a laundry room while the addition project was being completed, they decided to shift their focus to the basement. They wanted to create a second laundry room that could be used when they're ready to pursue an addition, as well as provide additional living space, bathroom, and a place for their dogs to hang out when the owners are not home. The existing windows were retained and created the basis for the living space. A Duramax LVT flooring was installed in the living space and hallway. In the new bathroom, a large walk-in shower was included with a bench and separate shower wand nearby, making it easy to wash the dogs when necessary. Kohler Devonshire fixtures were installed, and South Cypress chimney rock in a shell color was used for the shower tile. The spacious new laundry room was fitted with new cabinet core cabinets in shaker white and topped with light silt quartz. The basement now provides a clean template for the owners to decorate and use, while also ready to serve them when they decide to tackle the main floor addition. With their kids getting older, these homeowners wanted to provide a fun space for their kids and their friends to hang out close to home. The large unfinished basement was the perfect space to create a variety of zones for entertaining, working out, and storage. The main entry stair was redirected to flow directly into the basement and create space for a half bath. The living area features a large projection screen for watching movies and games with an LED tape light in the cove ceiling above that can be adjusted to any color. A one and a half inch thick slab of oiled hickory wood was selected to top the knee wall, allowing for bar height seating behind the living room and adjacent to the new wine room. The nearby kitchen boasts an extra long island with plenty of counter seating and beautiful copper pendants above. All new black stainless appliances blend nicely with the midnight color of the cabinets and contrast with the light gray backsplash tile. The game room features a new shuffleboard table and custom pool table with a wall-mounted TV to ensure no one is ever too far away from the action. The new CrossFit workout room features custom rubber mats, a projector, and workout equipment. One of the most interesting features of the space is the corner aquarium which can be seen from nearly every spot in the basement. This project succeeded in providing this close-knit family with a place where they can all hang out and relax together. This homeowner wanted their home's exterior to have a classier appearance. They also requested the addition of a wood-burning fireplace, so a new masonry chimney needed to be blended into the home without making it look like it was out of place. The existing porch skirting was replaced with 1x6 treated boards stained to match the deck color. The utility services were hidden by a custom-built enclosure with access doors duplicating the material and finish used on the deck skirt boards. 1x6 tongue and groove cedar boards were installed on both of the front and rear porch ceilings. A custom handmade rail system was designed 
and custom corbels installed on the front and back porch posts. Double posts were placed at the entry on the front porch to provide a more defined inviting appearance. A custom copper sap shroud was placed on the chimney as a focal point for the home. Custom cedar shutters were added to further enhance the home's appearance. From both the front and back, the home's exterior is now classy, cozy, and inviting. The client loved the look of their 1940s home, but knew it was dated. The goal was to keep the home's originality while giving it a facelift. Most of the materials were unsalvageable, resulting in the replacement of most of the exterior siding and all of the cedar shake. New plank siding from James Hardy was installed, and a premium striated cedar shake was used to obtain the home's original look. The homeowner wanted to paint the siding a dark blue, and after sampling 15 to 20 different paints, settled on the perfect shade of navy, Sherwin-Williams Navy Seawall. The dark color contrasts with the cedar shake and ties in the home's original masonry work. This exterior remodel has restored the home's character while giving lots of curb appeal. An exterior makeover was in order for this house, but the style needed to be consistent with the rest of this older neighborhood. The facelift began with the installation of a new shingled roof with hardy shakes added to the dormer for a unique look. Stone and a custom-built copper chimney cap were used to update the existing chimney. New cedar board and batten shutters were added to enhance the windows. The front stoop was resurfaced with flagstone and a new front door and lantern-type light fixtures installed to accent the main entrance. A custom-built curved copper awning was placed as the centerpiece to the home. The exterior was painted and color-coordinated gutters with round downspouts were installed. The home's exterior has been beautifully updated while still blending in with the style of the rest of the neighborhood. After a family member suffered a stroke, this home needed a more functional design to accommodate wheelchair use. With a love of cooking and entertaining, it was imperative to give the client all the necessities of a functioning kitchen. A handicap accessible cooktop was installed with a remote activated hood vent, touch activated faucets and a built-in microwave in the lower cabinets add to the accessibility. The existing powder room was eliminated to create space for a personal craft desk that includes a sink. In the master bathroom, the shower floor was dropped for a curbless shower to make it easy to get in and out. Grab bars and handheld fixtures were also added. The existing cabinets were removed and new design cabinets and countertops installed at a more comfortable height. The renovation carried over into the existing garage, which was converted into a flex room, new laundry room, and half bath. A luxury vinyl tile was used throughout to create a smooth floor that would provide no obstacles to impede wheelchair mobility. These new spaces have made the client's daily routine easier and more comfortable for their lifestyles. Having enjoyed many years in their home, these homeowners were ready to make the changes necessary to ensure they could age in place there. A seven foot wide addition was created along the side of their home to allow for a new master bathroom. Keeping the possibility of future wheelchair use in mind, extra large porcelain tiles were installed while transitioning to the zero entry shower with corresponding mosaic tile. Customized blue-gray cabinets were paired with bright white quartz countertops that wrapped the wall to backdrop the wall-mounted vanity faucets. An ADA height toilet with self-cleaning functions is tucked out of the way. An in-ceiling heater was installed above the shower entry to make getting in and out of the shower a more comfortable experience. The large shower door slides easily on rollers and shower grab bars, a bench, and handheld shower head add to the ease of bathing. The homeowner requested a dream closet with a priority placed on shoe storage. Every pair of shoes now has a place of its own in the new design, while the other closet walls offer storage for the homeowner's full wardrobe so that she no longer has to store out of season items in the attic. The new roof line on the master suite was carried over to the existing carport, allowing for an expansion to accommodate another vehicle 
and give space for handicap accessible parking if ever needed. These homeowners are now well equipped to remain in their beloved home for many years to come. mission for this edition was to increase the usable space in their home, and the homeowners had several items on their wish list to make their home more functional. With the existing living room getting overrun with baby toys and furniture forced to pull double duty, they were ready to reclaim their living room as an adult space and relocate the toys and their large dog's crate to a secondary space. Built in place of their old porch, the new playroom edition was sized to accommodate more guest seating and can be converted into a guest suite if needed. The ceilings were vaulted and new hardwood floors stained to match the existing floors in the rest of the house. Savvy Storage Solutions incorporated the dog crate into the design, giving their sweet pup a space to call home. The washer and dryer were relocated from the carport storage closet to the addition, and a powder room was added to complete the space. To accommodate their love of entertaining, a large screened porch was designed featuring a vaulted ceiling painted blue and an outdoor fan. Pendant lights over the farmhouse table and sconces installed on the porch columns give the space a pleasing ambiance for outdoor living. This small but mighty addition packs in a host of functional solutions that will help this family stay put for many years to come. While this cottage style home had the overall look its owners wanted, two front entrance doors gave it the appearance of a duplex. Their goal was to preserve both entrances by modifying the secondary door for more personal use while maintaining the primary front door for visitors. The secondary door was rotated 90 degrees so that it no longer faced the street. This allowed for the extension of the front hallway off the kitchen, changing both the interior space and redefining the roof lines. A three-sided, fully windowed sitting room was created, giving the homeowners a sunlit space to sit and enjoy the grounds. The area between the new expansion and primary front door was excavated and rebuilt to accommodate a garden. Split stairs and a stucco wall matching the home's foundation allow access through the garden area. To keep the look consistent with the existing home, large format porcelain tile resembling blue stones was used for step treads and stepping stones. The duplex design is gone, the curb appeal enhanced, and the resulting space is both usable and welcoming. Avid automotive enthusiasts, these homeowners had run out of space for their growing car collection. After years of storing cars and parts in the basement, there was nowhere else to go. It was time to create a dedicated car garage to properly store, maintain, and show off their collection. A two-story garage was created off the right corner of the existing house with room for four vehicle bays. Keeping auto servicing in mind, Poured concrete walls with multiple electrical outlets were set at the workbench height. Cabinetry runs along the back wall of the other three bays to accommodate tools and parts. A two-car carport was added to the front of the garage for exterior workspace. The second story of the garage ties in with the newly rebuilt rear porch and deck areas that were also part of this project. New stairs leading from the deck area allow access to the lower portion of the garage while the upstairs storage area is accessed by a new screened breezeway. The garage allowed homeowners to reclaim portions of their home that had been overtaken by their hobby and gives ample space for working on their passion for cars in a seating that blends seamlessly with the rest of the house. Soon after completing plans for their home, these homeowners found out that baby number three was on the way. The size of the lot allowed for an addition as the perfect way to adapt to this family's new needs. The new space was designed to feel and look similar to the rest of the house. Connecting the spaces by a hallway off the existing kitchen provided easy access with room for the addition of a large pantry, which features custom freestanding shelving and antique doors. A master suite was designed with vaulted ceiling and cedar beams. The master bath includes a freestanding tub between custom vanities and a shower tuck between custom shelving and storage. The master closet was outfitted for the size and needs of the clients, 
Hardwood flooring throughout the master suite made it feel open and airy. The screened-in porch is accented by old Chicago brick that matches the interior laundry room and half bath. A custom split door was added to give the porch a cozy farmhouse feel. These design elements achieve the goal of giving a cohesive feel to the existing home and its new addition. A master suite should be a place to relax and retreat, but this existing space allowed for neither. Removing the dated stone fireplace in the master bedroom and installing a firebox encased in white marble opened the space up. Motorized sliding doors were installed to take in the view and bring light into the once dark space. A luxurious spa bath was added with refrigeration drawers, handcrafted tile, and a dual customizable shower system. A new two-person spa in its own wet room features custom iron windows that open to the mountain view. Mirrored cabinets over the vanities provide additional hidden storage. The new fully customized closet is complete with built-in television, multiple dressing areas with marble countertops, and pendant lighting. The high-gloss finish on the cabinetry makes the closet feel as large as possible while using every inch of space for storage. From dark, dated, and depressing to open, bright, and relaxing, this space has taken on new life and is finally the relaxing retreat it was meant to be. This family with four small children had drastically outgrown their existing living spaces. To meet their growing needs, the back of the house was expanded by a 4,000 square foot addition. The addition included a new living room open to a casual dining area. A spacious kitchen features custom cabinetry, a large center island, and all the bells and whistles a cook could desire. The new master suite includes a luxurious bath with steam shower and soaker tub. Also included in the addition were a new laundry room, expanded children's bedrooms, a playroom with built-ins for storing toys and games, and a screen porch with outdoor fireplace, ceiling fan, and TV for outdoor entertaining. The homeowner's passion for collecting fine wines was further enhanced with the addition of a custom wine cellar in the finished basement. Thanks to the addition, the homeowners now have plenty of room to live comfortably while raising their little ones. Although the homeowners wanted a larger bathroom, their home's floor plan limited the ability to expand. With a huge tub taking up unused space, the decision was made to remove the tub and reconfigure the space to allow for a larger shower and toilet area. White subway tiles, glass enclosure, and Calcutta Laza quartz made this space feel much bigger than its actual 70 square feet. The old toilet location provided the length needed to install a much-needed double vanity. A custom-made cypress barn door was installed to access the bathroom easier while also enhancing the wall in the master bedroom. This bath has become a much more functional space without adding square footage. After experiencing a house fire, these homeowners decided to seize the opportunity to create a brand new updated master bath. With renovations going on in the rest of the house, the budget was tight and each design move had to be very intentional to get the most bang for the buck. Opening up the walls separating the vanity from the shower and toilet room made the space feel triple its previous size. The small cramped shower was replaced with a spacious one featuring large format porcelain tile complemented with hexagonal tile. A corresponding quartz with heavy veining was added to the vanity area. The 80s jacuzzi tub that was oversized and underused was replaced with a clawfoot tub in navy. Shiplap was added as a cost-effective tub surround and a recessed storage niche was incorporated into it to keep books, candles, bath salts, and other necessities at arm's reach during bath time. With thoughtful design, the remodeler was able to take what seemed like insurmountable circumstances and turn them into a space that the homeowners will enjoy for many years to come. 
This bathroom was nothing short of dull at the start. The homeowner set forth a directive to create a master bath worthy of a spa experience while staying within budget. Retaining the original bath's footprint enabled more of the budget to be devoted to design impact. The existing shower was gutted and the floor dropped down to create a curbless shower. With wood blocking installed in the walls for future grab bars, the shower will accommodate aging in place gracefully. The homeowner requested a place to sit and apply makeup, so a sink was eliminated to make room for a makeup vanity. To create a relaxing atmosphere, Philip Jeffries was commissioned to customize a mural pattern and print it on vinyl, allowing the mural to be placed in a wet area without fear of water damage. The adjacent areas were wallpapered in a coordinating vinyl grass cloth to accent the mural and add texture to the walls. In the end, the use of soft color, pattern, and light turned this dull bathroom into a beautiful blossom. This dated bath with a small acrylic shower and an oversized garden tub was in need of transformation. The knee wall was removed and the bathroom reconfigured to increase the space available for a shower. A dowel tile subway tile was installed on the walls with a small hexagon marble look tile applied to the shower floor. Dark grout and a wand showering system add to the high-end feel, while a frameless shower door and glass transom give additional space. A freestanding tub with sloping lines was installed. Floating shelves were added alongside the tub as a place for bath salts, candles, and soaps. A double vanity featuring well-worn cabinets and undermount sinks was installed. Although the space already had natural daylight, Additional lighting was needed and came in the form of several can lights as well as the addition of black framed sconces on the double vanity and a black curry chandelier mounted over the top. The once typical bathroom is now anything but typical thanks to this remodel. The original galley style master bath offered no privacy as it also functioned as a guest bath Dividing the area into two spaces gave the homeowners the privacy they desired while adding function and storage. The new powder bath features a custom demi loon console, satin brass plumbing, and antique brass and crystal lighting fixtures. A detailed pocket door gives access to the new adjoining master bath. Marble look porcelain tile for low maintenance was used on the floor. Custom beaded inset cabinetry was installed and topped with Alabama white marble countertops. A separate makeup area for daily prep was installed, providing additional storage and lighting. Newport brass polished chrome plumbing and delicate lighting give extra detail to this space. Not only does this new design give the privacy desired, but both the guest and master baths are now updated and sophisticated. Built in the 80s, this home had good bones, but the outdated floor plan did not function for a family of today. The existing master bath was small and did not offer enough space. Carving a few square feet from the adjoining garage and demolishing a tiny dysfunctional laundry area allowed for the creation of a master suite that's high on functionality and style. The original bath was open to the bedroom, so a new wall and pocket door were installed to create separation and privacy. An entire wall of the bathroom was covered in white tile to provide a seamless expanse running through the glass shower and offer a backdrop for the classic freestanding soaker top. Custom cabinetry packed with storage and beautifully trimmed in white gives the room a high-end boutique feel. The dark tile floor and black ceiling add drama and are a crisp foil to the white cabinetry and tile work. In the end, the homeowners got everything they wished for. It's all there in black and white.
With limited space, it was a challenge to redesign the existing space to create a master bathroom. But this remodeler rose to the occasion. The wall associated with the vanity was moved six feet to accommodate the new bathroom layout. Part of the existing master closet was claimed for a new walk-in shower. The existing stairs were removed to make way for a new toilet room and linen closet. An oval tub was created with a unique wood surround and Calcutta marble. The same marble was used for the vanity top, shower walls, floor, ceiling, and niche. The metalwork used throughout the room was non-lacquered brass to allow for rapid patina development. Antique heart pine flooring was installed to continue the effect from the master bedroom. An existing hallway was converted to the new master closet with custom shelving and hanging rods installed for efficient use of space. The result is a beautiful master bathroom that allows efficient flow from space to space and satisfies the homeowner's vision and dreams. This existing bath was serving not only as the master bath, but also as the bathroom for guests and children. To give the homeowners their own space to retreat to after a long day at the office, the bath was expanded to accommodate a large wood custom double vanity. The old dark cramped shower was exchanged for a luxurious shower with steam function. Roll plumbing fixtures in a polished chrome finish were used to keep the home's traditional feel while updating the aesthetic. A soaking tub was placed in the heart of the bathroom's bay window. White marble and countertops were incorporated throughout. The new space has become the sanctuary that the clients longed for. A previous remodel had created a large master bedroom, but left an undersized master bath and closet, which did not work for the new homeowners. The new design features a custom inset vanity spanning the length of the bathroom to give his and hers prep areas, as well as a makeup area. Marble floors, shower, and countertops all give the space the feel of luxury and warmth. A frameless shower enclosure hugs the marble waterfall bench and is a showcase for the marble mosaic used on the shower floor and niche. Delta plumbing in a champagne bronze finish provides contrast with the marble. For an added detail, marble subway tile was installed in a herringbone pattern on the vanity wall and capped off with satin brass lighting. The new design also included the creation of his and hers master closets. By utilizing what had been wasted space in the master bedroom, this project captured valuable square footage to create the peaceful space these homeowners needed. After undergoing several large renovation projects, this house started showing a sore spot. The grand staircase and hall bath, located at the heart of the home, were long neglected and begging for the same treatment the rest of the house had received. For the staircase, wood trim paneling was installed to bring style and design interest to the rather blank pass-through space. The outdated adjustable can lights were replaced with new LED recessed trim kits to bring adequate lighting to the previously dim space and a new large scale brushed brass pendant and wall sconces were added. In the hall baths, the original mid-century tile was replaced with marble floors laid in a herringbone pattern. Matching marble tile was installed on the walls surrounding the new cast iron tub with a recessed storage niche accented with a smaller scale marble tile to complement the floor. To allow the tile to remain the focal point of the room, a single hinged glass panel was installed on the shower rather than hiding the tile behind a shower curtain. All new plumbing fixtures make the bathroom feel clean and fresh, while wainscot trim, new paint, and the addition of LED lighting brighten up this windowless space. What were once forgotten pass-through spaces in an overlooked area of the house have now become stylish centerpieces that the homeowners enjoy daily.
With the lower levels of this home only housing two bedrooms, the homeowners wanted to make the most of their attic and create more guest amenities. The upper landing was turned into a master guest suite with plenty of room for a queen-size bed, as well as an intimate seating area. In order to provide natural light into the attic, a dormer was created with a window seat encased in shiplap that gives room for running ductwork underneath. The lower level of the attic was turned into a bunk room with custom bunk beds for grandchildren, fully equipped with built-in TVs at the head of each bed. The step-up was camouflaged with a barn door in order to make sure it did not look like an afterthought. A full bathroom was added to provide comfort for guests and was equipped with a spacious walk-in shower. A custom vanity was created from wooden beams that the remodeler had collected over the years. Although this guest corridor is in the attic, the remodeler managed to create a feeling of depth, height, and movement that the clients loved while creating more sleeping space for family and friends. Although this family loved the location of their historic 1949 home, they needed more space. The attic was a great space to take over, but the existing stairs were as steep as a ladder and tucked away in a closet. Removing the walls in the front foyer gave the new staircase a natural entry. The curving handrail set this stair apart with its unique style. The attic was transformed with the addition of two bedrooms with plenty of closet space and built-ins for added storage. A study area was created off the landing with built-in desks and bookcase. The space also saw the addition of a bathroom featuring a subway tiled shower and custom vanity. The new floor tile was selected to incorporate the period style of the house below, adding over 1,100 square feet of living space to the home. This project has proven to be a great return on investment and a means for the family to stay in their preferred location. This remodeler was challenged to update the interior of this old building. And on an incredibly tight deadline of only two weeks, new sheetrock was installed in place of the old square ceiling tiles. Over 50 recessed lights were added throughout to brighten up the space. Crown molding was installed throughout and a fresh coat of paint applied to every wall, ceiling, door, and piece of trim. The faded and wrinkled carpet was replaced with new carpet and the conference room window boxes were faced in sheetrock and capped with a painted wood top. In the workroom, the hardwood floors were sanded down and refinished to match the other 90-year-old flooring. The back doors that were nearly rusted shut were replaced with new emergency steel doors. The back ramp was removed and a covering added. The remodeler was able to get the project completed within a short timeline and meet the client's needs for a complete transformation. The location was perfect. But after 18 years, this construction company had outgrown the small neighborhood home that had served as its office. With no space for new employees, it was time for an overhaul that would create a more professional and technological experience for customers buying a home. The new raised parapet elevation represents a more commercially fitting space and allows the company's signage to project a warm and professional image to those passing by. The data drop-down ceilings were removed exposing the ceiling choice, which gave the space an airy feel. Hardwood floors, wood walls, and exposed brick add warmth throughout. The spacious showroom offers a place for home buyers to view options for customizing their home with a large TV monitor to help show what the finished results could look like. The once dark and cramped office space is now spacious, bright, and full of character, and it better showcases this company in its high traffic location. This home was in the right location for this family, but the house itself had a host of issues, from lack of space to outdated design to security concerns. Thus began the major overhaul, which included moving the kitchen wall two feet to enlarge the eating space. What was formerly a child's bedroom with a door leading to the outside was turned into an entry 
with a newly relocated laundry room, powder room, and coat closet. The master bathroom, previously decked out in a rose pink tile scheme, was dramatically updated with new vanities, along with a new herringbone subway tile shower and built-ins for additional storage. The home's steep attic staircase was rebuilt to lead to the new living quarters upstairs. Two new bedrooms were added in the attic, along with a new full bath featuring tile that pays homage to the home's historic style. Fresh paint throughout completed the look. This extensive project managed to be completed during the summer break and enabled the family to be settled back into their home they loved before the new school year began. Having worked with these clients on two previous houses, it was no surprise that the remodelers were tapped a third time when the homeowners decided to move back to the area. The fixer-upper they purchased was in a great location, but one of the worst-looking homes on the block. The remodelers remedied that with a complete transformation of the exterior, including a much more welcoming entrance with a cozy seating area. Inside, the layout was choppy, with closed-off rooms and oddly placed windows. Walls were removed to open up the space between the living room and kitchen. The existing kitchen was only wide enough to fit one person at a time, so a much larger, brighter kitchen was in order. A new large center island, modern pendant lighting, fresh white cabinets with brass hardware, and a dramatic tile backsplash give the space a total wow factor. The old master bathroom had wasted space, so the layout was reconfigured to make the most sense and provide the most functionality. The bath features a large soaker tub inside the massive walk-in shower. Careful design allowed them to maximize every square inch of this small home and take it from mid-century to thoroughly modern. With dreams to move back to their preferred area and open a vet clinic, these clients purchased this house for its location and lot but it was obvious that some major changes were needed. To achieve the open concept home their active family desired, walls were removed that separated the dining, living, and kitchen. The eight-foot ceilings were vaulted to 14 feet in the living room. A large kitchen island was designed to serve as the focal point for gatherings or early morning breakfast. Modern sconces and pendants actuate the rich cabinet color while butcher block and marble bring depth to the countertops and streamlined brass hardware adds a modern touch. A new buffet was created with a hex tile mosaic backsplash and wooden shelves, offering a place for serving or entertaining. A nursery was located off the dining room with an antique sliding door separating the spaces. Hardwood flooring creates an even flow throughout. Thanks to good bones, this home was able to get the updates it deserved and allow this family's dream home to come true. Recently retired, this couple was moving back to a traditional brick rancher that they had owned for many years. However, they wanted to update it to an open concept with a master suite and plenty of outdoor living space. Most of the walls in the home's main living space were removed or reconfigured to achieve the open concept they desired, with vaulted ceilings, custom lighting, and a home automation system. The new kitchen features a large kitchen island and walk-in pantry. A new side entrance portico was added to allow easy access to the new mudroom and laundry room. An addition was built to house the master bedroom, and one of the existing bedrooms was converted into the master bath. The space now includes a custom curbless shower, double vanity, and heated floors. The master suite has access to the spacious covered patio at the home's rear, which features a gas fireplace and views of the backyard. The home's exterior got a new paint job, along with a new roof and windows. Taking a traditional rancher and transforming it into a more spacious open design has given these homeowners their dream retirement home. A devastating house fire that began in the chimney and spread through the attic and upstairs level forced this family to recreate and remodel the home they had purchased a year before. One of the only portions of the original home that remained was the exterior brick, which was painted white. The interior design shifted from a traditional to a more modern style in terms of finishes and furnishings. The kitchen, which originally featured stained wood cabinets with raised panel doors, was transformed with a waterfall island and white painted shaker cabinets. 
The dining room was relocated to what was originally a closed off formal living room. Relocating the dining area enabled the bedrooms and bath to expand in size. The homeowners also decided to extend the roof line in the rear of the home and add a fireplace and outdoor kitchen to create a true backyard retreat which has become the place where the children go to relax, even in the winter. What began as a tragic situation turned into a beautiful opportunity for this family to create the home they had been dreaming of. A steep lot created elevation challenges for this home remodel. Retaining walls over 10 feet tall in some areas had to be built and incorporated into the home's design to make them aesthetically pleasing. Because this project was a spec home, the remodeler took care to choose higher end finishes and colors that would be appealing to a wide range of buyers. The interior features custom trim work throughout, such as the wainscoting in the dining room and the drop zone in the entry. Classic gray cabinetry and a large center island offer plenty of storage and prep space in the kitchen. The same marble was used in the bathroom vanities as in the kitchen to create a cohesive look. Although most of the finishes throughout are neutral, some color was brought in through the hex tiles in the laundry room and the concrete tile in the entry for a fun touch without overdoing it. A screen porch was added for enjoying the outdoors year round. A buyer came along as the remodel neared completion and absolutely fell in love with the home, leading to a happy ending for this spec project. This adorable cottage home was in need of updating and expanding before the homeowners started their family. They loved the look of their home's exterior, so the expansion carried that look over with cedar shakes and a triple roof pitch. Inside, a barrel ceiling adds a touch of drama to the new entryway. A drop zone painted navy blue with herringbone brick tile provides an elegant place for coats and bags. The kitchen was expanded to include a large center island and new cabinetry. The 6x12 Carrera marble tile backsplash features a herringbone pattern behind the open shelving to create a fun focal point. The kitchen opens into the living room, which is now centered by a show-stopping double-sided fireplace that can be enjoyed both indoors and outside on the spacious porch. Custom arch doorways in the master bedroom lead to the master bath, which now houses a soaker tub that is separated from the large shower by a curved shiplap pony wall. The couple discovered near the end of the project that a baby was on the way. So now they get to create new memories as a family of three in their newly remodeled home. A project that began as merely remodeling the downstairs and restrooms, removing a couple of walls and repainting the home, soon turned into a total renovation. The home's original front exterior lacked symmetry. Redesigning and rebuilding the front of the home allowed for a French quarter design with four mahogany doors, wrought iron work, copper lighting, and the balcony. Inside, custom millwork was added throughout the house, along with accent walls of reclaimed brick. A wood floor constructed of antique heart pine, reclaimed from the original Old Crow distillery, was installed throughout the living and dining areas. The kitchen saw a dramatic transformation with new cabinets and appliances, a large island, and granite countertops. The original master bath was reconfigured to create true his and her master bathrooms. Using tundra gray marble tile throughout, the space includes a soaking tub for her and a shower for him. Separate master closets meet in a shared area that creates a U to connect the bath and closet suites. Originally built in the 1950s, this home now showcases the best of both classic design and modern amenities. These homeowners had already been in talks with the remodeler about creating an outdoor space and carport along with a den addition, but a tree falling on the back of their house added urgency to putting their plans into motion. Below the new addition, a brick columned porch was constructed that can be accessed from the carport or basement. A 22 by 26 foot deck was added above the carport. A pergola on each side provides structural support and anchors the roof structure to the house. Pine V-groove ceilings were installed on the deck with wrought iron railings surrounding the perimeter. 
A six by eight foot open grilling deck keeps the grill area away from the sitting and dining areas and where children play. The existing retaining wall was incorporated into the design, helping to clearly define the outdoor space. The elevated space provides the perfect vantage point for watching the children play in the backyard. The project exceeded the homeowner's expectations, and they are thrilled that the normally devastating event of a tree hitting their house was well-timed to allow them to realize the backyard they had dreamed of. Although their home is located in the traditional garden district, these homeowners are anything but traditional. Early in the project, they named the pool house and outdoor living area the mullet house, reflecting the business in the front party in the back contrast of the main house and outdoor living area. Tasked by the owners to think outside the box and do something no one else in the neighborhood had done, the remodeler created a pool house with plenty of unique design touches. Metal from a recently demolished old barn was used for the ceiling and accents, with ductwork left exposed. Whitewashed tuba six pine was installed on the walls. Custom epoxy floors were poured. Commercial grade kitchen equipment was installed under the covered patio to be used no matter what the weather. TVs and ample seating both inside the pool house and outside on the patio make this an ideal entertaining space. The couple now has an outdoor haven that reflects their eclectic personality and style. This home's interior had undergone multiple renovations, but now it was time to address the owner's desire to connect with the outdoors more. They wanted an exterior retreat, a place where they could relax over a cup of coffee or entertain and watch football games and grill out. The result was a 16 by 20 screened porch structure that is accessed by a covered breezeway from the downstairs den. The porch was constructed from rough cut cedar columns and cedar wrapped beams with the ceiling consisting of exposed rafters and V-groove clear pine, all clear coated to show off the wood's natural warmth. Wood burning fireplace is made of stacked stone with a slate hearth from Acme brick. The mantle is rough cut reclaimed barn wood with a custom cabinet with bifold doors made from mixed reclaimed wood for enclosing the TV. The concrete floor was highlighted with a saw cut pattern and a warm beige stain to coordinate with the cedar. The pendant light and remote control ceiling fans from inline lighting were chosen in shades of bronze. The owners absolutely love their new space. As it is brought to fruition, their hopes of being outside more and enjoying their backyard in a way they hadn't been able to before. This client wanted two pairs of large wooden doors built in a period style in keeping with the 80-year-old building that he uses as a garage for his car collection. The client had removed several heart pine joists from the building's floor framing, and that proved to be the perfect material for constructing the doors. Nails were removed from the reclaimed lumber, which was then sized and planed to a common thickness. Each door is five feet wide, nine feet tall, and three and a half inches thick weighing approximately 350 pounds. The door panels were covered in 16-gauge galvanized metal sheets to add security and then covered in tongue and groove beadboard that had been harvested from the building as well. Large iron gate hinges were made for the doors to add the finishing touch. The doors swing and close with little effort and have proven to be just the right complement to this historic building. Although this room's existing windows let light in, it didn't provide the view that the homeowner desired in the newly remodeled space. Removing the full exterior 20-foot wall and installing an engineered steel beam allowed for the installation of custom Marvin multi-slide remote controlled doors. At over nine feet tall, the doors give access to the stunning views outside anytime. Motorized draperies mean the room can go from day to night with the push of a button. A new fireplace was installed to provide warmth and ambience without disrupting the view. The new doors have enabled the homeowner to bring the outdoors in any time of the year. There were two primary goals for this project. Create a stronger connection to the basement and laundry room 
and make the stairs feel like interior space rather than garage space. The existing stairs required the homeowners to circulate through the garage to access their rec room, laundry, guest bedroom, and office. To resolve this issue, the stair orientation was flipped 180 degrees, positioning the top of the staircase next to the front door where a coat closet had previously been. The bottom of the staircase now opens directly into the basement rec room with the door added for easy access to the garage. A wall was built in the garage to enclose the stairs as interior conditioned space. The rickety treads with open risers were replaced with site finished hardwood treads and painted wood risers. Upstairs, the full height wall separating the living room from the staircase was taken down to a half height knee wall to bring more light into the basement. A more functional mudroom closet was added opposite the stairs adjacent to the kitchen. This simple switch has allowed the family to maximize their use of space while injecting a strong dose of personality into the place they call home.